Okay, here we are at Kitami Kai. We have arrived. Look what God did. God did. Inyeri nango. Yeah. Kit me kai. Look what God did. Playing Legos. Angel do lu. Martin. Eh, o gangue o Kiswahili. Yes, sir. So here we are. Kit me kai. I'm gonna reverse. Do 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 do. Okay. So what I didn't know is this is this is a national site. I didn't know it was that serious. And I'm gonna stop talking so they don't charge me as a tourist. But here we go. UNESCO. Yes, sir. A historic site. People come here to pray. People come here to tour. But essentially, it's some um, well arranged rocks. Okay. So here we are at Kitmi Kai. Right there is where you pay. 150. 150 shillings per person. Okay, so we're here. Very interesting path. Squeeze between two rocks. God's design. God's design. God's expectations. Okay. You said learn? Yeah. Okay. It's okay if I record you? Yeah. yeah. Okay. It's okay. All right. It's so time to get a little lit. <laughs> so first of all, my, my name is Bernard Ndenya um, Mazaga. I work here as a tour guide. So feel most welcome to Kitumika, the historic rock. <laughs> so we kind of have some briefings about the rock. Mm -hmm. what used to be here, what used to happen, you know. Uh, so first of all, we should know Kitumikai means what, uh, you know. Uh, you know, we lose, we call uh, rocks Kidi. Mm -hmm. yeah. uh, so we have uh, Kitumikai, we also have the Mekai. Mm -hmm. The know? wife. Uh, the first wife. First you know, wife. They used to be polygamous and even now, mm -hmm. they are polygamous now, you see. So the first wife was referred to as Mekai. We had the second one also called Nyachira. Then we also had the third one, Nyarele. Otherwise, the three had, uh, the, the three were too official, see? Otherwise, somebody was allowed to do even a hundred, you know? Yes, a hundred. Uh -huh. uh, so they, they were polygamous people. Yeah. Uh, so uh, again, you know, it was, uh, by the time the lands were vast, mm -hmm. you know? Somebody, if somebody wanted to do a homestead, then there were two options one would do. Option one, you, if you have identified somewhere you want to do that homestead, then you take a chicken, you go, you tie it there. So tomorrow if you go there, if you miss it, then something is wrong with that place. You don't have to do that homestead there. Mm. You have to look for another place. You see now. Yeah. Then option two, uh, if you have identified somewhere you want to do that homestead, or you, you roam all night. I hope you roamed one day all night. And if you reach somewhere, you find somewhere a little bit warm. So you put a mark. See now? You put a mark there. So that one is the right place for you to do that homestead. Yeah. So in this case, we had uh, one old man by name Ngeso Kosanjo. Ngeso Kosanjo. Kosanjo. Okay. He was also looking for somewhere to do a homestead now. So mm. the moment he reached here, you know, he went inside. Then inside, I told you we have caves inside now. 
Mm. Uh, so he found it's kind of a room inside. Mm -hmm. you know? So he said, let me stay in for a while. Mm. You see now? But later, he went and did his homestead. I hope you, by the time you were coming, you, there was a, a public primary school you've seen here, just nearby here. Uh, what was it called? Mana? Mufungeso. Mana. Mm. From Mana, you come from Mufungeso. You see? Uh -huh. From Mana to Mufungeso. You see? Mm -hmm. uh, so, that uh, public primary school was mm. The old one left, he went and did his homestead there. Mm. No. But uh, for the love of this rock, the old one used to be here very early in the morning. You know? uh, we had. Uh, that uh, there is a low traditional stool, it has to be like a yeah, yeah. Yeah. somewhere, yeah. Like portable, you know, you know? You so we used to carry it, uh -huh. so he, he would sit there, Mama. then when he was tired, now he would go into, that is room to maybe to rest or meditate, you mm -hmm. see, now, mm -hmm. yeah, so he went on to do that, such that even if he had visitors at the homestead, then the guests had to be referred just to go to the rock with the old man there, <laughs> you know, and uh, Mekai Nuo, you see, that lady was very, 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 very key. The moment you wanted to do the second wife, then you really need to consult with her. And uh, in Luo, if, we, if tomorrow we were to go to do planting, then, then you have to spend that night in the Mikai's house. Oh. The same applies to harvesting. Tomorrow we are going to harvest, you have to sleep in that Mikai's house. So that lady was very, very key. Because even the moment you did the second wife, then, he would, she would stay with the second with, with his second wife to prove if she can really do something for you tangible no no nah? so the moment he proved you right then the old man had to build you your house now so, mm. so that lady was very cute so that was why they said the old man loved this rock as the first wife kit mekai rock of the first wife. the rock of the first wife oh. yeah, then number two here you know before christianity mm -hmm. Those people, what they knew was the one almighty God. Because mm. we had no Jesus. Mm -hmm. They used to call him Obongo Were Nyakalaga. Obongo, Obongo Were, Were Nyakalaga. Nyakalaga. Yes. Wow. Yeah. Yes. This so, is my first time hearing that. Uh, Obongo, Were Obongo, Nyakalaga. Obongo Were Nyakalaga. You know? Yeah. So the moment they were maybe facing challenges mm -hmm. or they wanted to do Thanksgiving now, you know, mm -hmm. maybe they had a bumper harvest down here. Mm -hmm. So this, this was one place they would assemble, then they would do those, those sacrifices. They would come with a goat and uh, maybe five hands. A goat so they slaughter them there, In they roast them, yes. At here at the foot uh, of the rock? Uh, from, where we, from, from where we were to start, oh. uh, you know, from yeah. where we were to start. So the, the, the moment the meat was, you know, those, that goat was, was not to be killed by, to be slaughtered by somebody we call the aliens now, somebody coming from outside. You mm -hmm. had to be a native. A native, a local. Yeah, a local, a native yeah. one, you know. Mm -hmm. yeah. So the moment the, the meat was ready, then they would uh, have a piece of uh, chicken and a piece of that goat meat now. Mm. Then they would raise now to the one almighty God, you know. Uh, because it was an offering for him. An offering, yeah. Uh, you know. So even if they needed the rents, then on the very day they would go back with the rents, you know. So you can imagine how close they were with that God. Mm. And like now you can, something small, you can come near a million times. Yeah. Yeah, you know now. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so that is, mm, they used to do. But right as of now, uh -huh. we don't slaughter anymore. Because we now, Jesus was now the sacrificial lamb. You know, so wow. it's, uh, right now, if you slaughter something here, yeah. then you will eat it on your own. You know? Oh, yeah. So now we do offering with money, right? Yeah, uh, with money. Now you church. can come here. You don't have to slaughter something, to slaughter anything here. Yeah. Because we had no Jesus. Yeah. Now we have Jesus now, and Jesus was the sacrificial lamb now. So everything now, you have to adore Jesus. Oh. You see now. So when they would slaughter an animal. Mm. What would they then do with the animal? They don't eat it? They, they eat it. Oh. But they were to eat it without uh, the ugalis now, you know? Raw? Uh, it was to, they, they, were, they, they were to consume it that way. Cooked? Cooked. cooked. Not oh. cooked, but uh, roasted. Roasted? Uh, roasted, no. Oh, okay. So it's they would animal. slaughter, uh, they offer roast. it to uh, Obongo, uh, Were, uh, Nyakalaga. Nyakalaga. Then, then, then finally everybody would uh, cut a piece. And then eat. they were to do it very fast because if uh, uh, if the offerings for, for were for rents, uh -huh. then some of them would even 
didn't even reach their homes. Take shelter. Yeah, you see now. Wow. Yeah, so that was so that they used to do those here now. Wow. wow. Yeah, here again, mm -hmm. we have these trees here. You can see them. They are Many very trees. rare outside there. Yeah, yeah they are. They are very rare. Yeah. You know, and uh, most of these are medicinal now. So, really. Yeah, we even have one down here. If you have uh, maybe tonsils now. Mm -hmm. You just uh, run around it, you sing the tonsils, 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 tonsils. So, uh, <laughs> the rounds now will depend on your strength now. See? <laughs> uh, you just sing it, then at the end of it all, you go free. Without pain. Uh, uh, the pain is uh, gone. Uh, the, the pain is gone now. You go around where? Uh, there is a tree down here. I'll show you when we are, when okay. we are done with the rocks now. What's the name of the tree? Uh, in Luo, it is called. Uh, Orembe. 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 Okay. Orembe. And it's a medicinal yeah. I think, tree. Uh, I think if you have an iPhone, yeah. then you can search. Uh, you can get the botanical name. Okay, okay. You see now. Orembe. Orembe. And those, so you don't consume the leaves, you just walk around. Uh, you just run around it. Wow. Yeah, wow, you wow. just run around <laughs> it. Tonsils, 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 singing, tonsils, singing. Tonsils, uh, singing, singing. You know now. Again, this rock I I, I, I hope you saw the history the historic rock now. I there did. is a point. When we reach, uh -huh. we will, you will see the world geographical maps now. They are mm. all here. Yeah. You know, they are all here. So you, can, you will ask yourself, how? For the whole world? Because, yeah, maps. Maps even for our Car Kenya, the Africa, Car the America. On yes, the yes, on the stones now, you see. Uh. And so you will ask yourself, how? Because we Kenyans, we found this stone here. Really? Yeah. Yes, we found it here. This, this stone has been here so since... It was carved. It was carved before anyone arrived. Yeah, it was already yeah. here. You know now. Okay. Yeah. So maybe in what year? It, it kind of a prediction. Nineteen hundred. Not nineteen hundred. Not nineteen. Not the nineteen. This this stone has been here ever since. And the carving was first noticed. No. So what remained was just the discovery of the maps. Now, otherwise, yeah, yeah. you know, like our Kenya, mm -hmm. uh, the Kenyans, we found it here. Then the the British came, they colonized, mm -hmm. you know, and finally they left at that map now, and already the map was here, you mm. know now, and even the Africa you are going to see. Then there is also a point. Oh, so it was here before. Uh, before everybody. Like oh. before everybody. Like just like the lake, you mm. see. Yeah, yeah, just like the lake. You can now, just stay you there. Mm. Mm. You see. Mm -hmm. Yes. So and uh, the results are point when we reach, we have a. A resting joint mm. so from there even mm. if it rains even if the sun shines that much mm -hmm. then you, there is a very good shelter there up mm. just you the that one is on top oh you see now it's called resting place so when you are there you are facing place. the lake this way now and we also have uh, the last stone on top of this the last stone on top of this yes if you look at it mm -hmm. geographically hmm, in front of it there is a very very nice curve. A curve. So, uh, that curve. Uh -huh. So that curve also has a kind of geographical mathematics. Mm. So there is an edge. There is this edge. The curve is this way. See this way. Yeah. So this edge you will see is pointing at the true north now. Really. And the other edge pointing at the south pole now. Really. See now. So when you are here, you will be able to know if you want to go to South Africa. Where do, where where do I go? Really. Yes. You know. Wow, if I want wow, to go to wow. Egypt, how? I want to go to USA. How? Mm -hmm. Where? Just look at the rock. See now, yeah. And again, we also have a, a viewpoint now. Yeah. See, from mm -hmm. there you can view the sunset and the rise. Mm. You see. Okay. Yeah. So we and even we, we always have some visitors here who do come just for that, mm. yeah, for the sunset yeah. and the rise. Now. We'll and return. They, and they just go back. We'll return for the sunset. Yeah. We'll return. No, no. Yeah. So those are things that are here. Oh. Yeah. In this rock now. Otherwise, there is also another feature. You know these rocks. Mm -hmm. There are some people who do say they are not that natural. Like if you look at that now, look, look, look at this one. You see that one? Yeah. That one. Yeah. yeah. That one is kind of a bracket. Kind of somebody, if you tamper with it, then I think you will be interfering with the whole system. Really? Yeah. If you look at it, oh. it, is, it is supporting this Wait, kind of. This this one here. Yeah. This one. You see? Wow. Yeah. He's referring to this rock, apparently, maybe holding up this. And if you look at this, you see these kind of stairs. Mm -hmm. Look at this one. They're mm -hmm. just this way. 
They are found this way. Yeah, they are just this way. So you step on this, you step on this, and you come down. Yeah. Then you go this way. Mm. Yeah. This way when you go into the caves. Wow. Yeah. So maybe okay. if you have any question. Any question. Hmm. So just just confirming. You said when when would it, when were these rocks first found? Mm, you know you know like we Kenyans we are all foreigners. Yeah, and we came from outside. Yeah, so before, uh, like, before uh, like from Sudan. We, yeah, we came from we came South all the Sudan. way not 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 necessarily Sudan, all the way all Egypt. the way from Egypt. Really? Yes, you know you know Lewis, they were they were very sharp people. They wanted to know yeah. the source of River Nile. Uh, you know. Yeah. Uh, you know you know even the pharaohs uh -huh. they were Lewis now. You know Lewis were the first to put up a university, the Alexandria University. That was theirs now. That was Nilots. Yeah, that was Nilots now, the Alexandria mm. University. Mm. And it was their first in Africa. Yeah. You see now. Mm -hmm. So what they want they wanted to know the, the source, the main source of the the, 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 the the river Nile. So that was why we came by this way. Otherwise this place, you know the river lake Nilots, the mm -hmm. plain Nilots, uh -huh. the Highland Nilots now. Yeah. The Highland Nilots now were the first people to arrive here. Mm. You know? Yes. They were and the that, first people. They were the first people. And even if you walk around, you will see some kind of uh, I can say the bones. Now you know they had no machineries. They had no uh, holes. Yeah. If somebody dies, then they just uh, leave you there. Even now you can see the bones. Yes, uh, there is a point there. If you if you go, you will see. Oh wow! Yeah. So they they stayed here. Then. There came the river Lake Nilots now, so they coexisted here. Okay. So, uh, but uh, there was a mystic that was done mm -hmm. by those guys. Now they killed uh, the young Luo guy here. Mm. So the moment they they heard the Luos were coming, then they fled. These Kalijans staying here in Kiboswa. Have you been to Kiboswa? Yes. Yeah. Uh, those 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 were those people. They were the first to be here. Really? Yes. But they fled just because of that. Oh, because they they uh, killed. They killed uh, yes. Yes. Uh, yes. Uh, 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 so uh, I'm trying to tell you, uh -huh. this rock has been here ever since. Okay. But there is also another thing. There is also another theory upcoming. Uh, that was I was telling you. There are some guys who are trying to say these rocks are not natural. Mm -hmm. They were kind of worked. Yes, by those people who did, who did those pyramids. Have you been to the pyramids? I've been to some pyramids, not here. In, uh, in Egypt. It was in South America. Oh, South America, but also yeah. we have pyramids there. Yeah. Uh, so they were trying to say that was why I was saying you know this Kitimikaya has a lot to do with the sun and even these things we call the equinox mm -hmm. they always uh, there are some people who do come here just to check on those like on September 23rd we have equinox here mm. yes okay. so those are things that are here and uh, they are yet to market it Mm. No, the moment they will market those things, then we will be having visitors yes, coming yes, just for many that. Visitors. Take, you know, How much is land around here? Yes. <laughs> like an acre of land. Uh, How much uh, is land? Uh, mm, that one is negotiable. Oh, okay. Uh, but uh, now I know the cost will rise. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Just yeah. because of the activities around. You know, we're coming. I didn't even know it was a national site until uh, until we arrived. Uh, so a UNESCO site. So. Okay. Yeah, so. Uh, We're going this way. Uh, uh, one, come, come, learn. Wow! Yeah. I did not know that there was Bring so much value, so much. Babe, I'll get it. Bring History. Your book. <laughs> so much science, yeah. mathematics. Uh, you know, I just all I knew is this was someone's first wife, quote unquote. Wow! So. It turns out that was a wise man. That was a wise man or very intuitive at the very least. So here we are. Let's see if you could get the view. Yes. I'm already very pleased, but here we go. Again, he was saying it looks like these were stairs, almost naturally made stairs and a path that leads straight to a cave up here. He also said that the rocks point at true north and true south. True north and true south. So the rocks served as a compass. 
as a compass. So, the final thing, or one, something else he said was, this rock here, this rock here, it kind of serves a purpose and secures, secures some things here. As if it was put here by something or someone or some being. Yes, sir. So here we are. wedged between rocks. Look at this. What kind of rock is this? It's hollow. Okay, so he also informed us that when people marry, they come here. And it establishes a secure bond. It makes it harder to divorce. And there we have Baba and Dad. There is also another explanation here. Uh -huh. Like from where we come from, mm -hmm. the altar number one down there. Mm -hmm. You know that one they say is for the is for the Saint Michael. Then the second one there is for the Saint Catherine. Then this one here is now for the Baba Melchior. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. Okay. Yeah, again, this point, you know, before this, mm -hmm. uh, you know, this is Seme now. Yeah. Uh, and the Seme is bordering Kisu yeah. municipality. Seme is bordering Vihiga County, also bordering Sierra now. So during those days, there were uh, those boundary browns now. Oh. Uh, like uh, Seme and Kisumu, they were arguing. The Kisumu people were trying to say, we have a bridge from Iago there, there is a bridge. So the Kisumu people were trying to say that should be the border. But Seme was saying no. So there were those boundary blocks now. Mm. So the moment they were going to those fights, mm -hmm. this was one place they used to do those meetings now. <laughs> you know, now wow. those serious uh, meetings. They used to do those meetings here and from there, there is a cage there. That one they used as the, now, now the armory. You know, they used to cook those crude weapons there. Mm -hmm. you no, know, no. And uh, those meetings, the moment they were being done, yeah. women were excluded in those meetings because like, suppose you are going to fight the Kisumu like people mm -hmm. and, you, and, and you have wives from there, mm -hmm. automatically there will be that betrayal now. So yeah. those meetings were specifically for men. Um, yes. Mm. And again, now I, I told you somebody had to bring the spouse here the moment you enter into money. Uh -huh. Then the, the spouse now would come with a grandpa now, you know, mm. uh, like just you've done wow. with your grandpa now. So the grandpa would wait for you here. Mm. Then the moment the, the lady reaches here, then they will do a jiggle now. Then you'll be given those old coins now, you throw into this water. We always have water here. Mm. No? So you have tied the knot. Wow. And so you are to be to stay as partners. Very interesting. Yes. Very interesting. So okay. we can get us to see. Look at the bats. Take care of the mark. Keep going. There's some bats chilling. Keep going. Sleeping. Doing what bats do. They really sleep upside down. Okay. So we made it out. A very important place. Very many decisions, important meetings have occurred here. Weddings, marriages. And now we're out. What do you think? Looks like he's meditating. Mm, 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 mm. What a beautiful view. But yes, so this is the famous seat of the great man. 
this point and place of deep meditation and contemplation. This was the seat of his wife. That is the view of the lake. Yes, sir. So now we head to the top. Okay, we've made it. This is this is the top. The highest you can do is there. Oh. Okay. Beautiful view of Seme. Beautiful view of Seme. Somehow there's trees way up here. This is all Seme. From Kitmikai. Kitmikai has been real. Job Jabungu signing off. Kit me Kai! You, you just allowed to me. Okay. Yes. Like so now we're leaving Bernard, the wonderful guide. <laughs> okay. Oriti. Oriti. Wanere. <laughs> okay, thank you. Okay. So this is a Matri. Yes, sir. About six people have gotten off, so there's a lot more room than normal. But yeah, we finished that Keep Me Kai, and for about 70 cents, it'll take you right back. Uh, Matatu will take you right back to Kisumu.